I wanted to show you my normal everyday makeup routine. And I'm actually, sorry, I'm just cleaning off my eyeshadow brush real quick. But, um, okay, so I'm going to go ahead and jump into it. First of all, I always moisturize. All I have is Beauty Lotion with SPS 15. I got mine from Rite Aid, and it is Rite Aid brand. So, go ahead and moisturize. What I've done already is gotten my previous night's makeup off. I'm not taking a shower today, so I'm not cleaning my face. But I did um, use some makeup remover towelette, some facial cleansing towelette uh, to treat it nicely. Okay, so I got that. Now, what I'm going to go do is start um, concealing. I use Bare Minerals. I have Medium Beige, a, uh, the original SPF 15 foundation that I use for concealer. It's just fine to use Bare Minerals for concealer. And I have naturally really dark under eyes. Um, as you can see, that that is not makeup that I just forgot to get off. That is my eyes. And um, so I start on my upper lid and go down to the bottom lid. Just patting it on and then kind of swirling it in right up into the last. I have some eyeliner that just I couldn't get off while taking my eyeliner off. So, um, you know, that's there, but I was just going to add to it so it wouldn't really matter. And this is just an everyday kind of makeup routine. I'm not going anywhere. I'm going to my mom's house, so it's not like I have to look super, super nice at all. So, okay, I'm finishing up my concealing here. As you can see, my eyes look a little bit better. I know. Saw some shadows. And by the way, this is a scar. Um, so, that's not like a... It's just a naturally occurring shadow. I can't get rid of it. So, um, so now I'm going to use the same foundation as foundation this time. And I'm going to use my Buki brush. Candy Buki brush. Came in a kit. I think it was actually my very first kit that I had. It just came in there. And I'm going to just start swirling all over. Do a nice even coverage. By the way, I'm sorry that um, I am using my webcam today. Um, my my uh, camera ran out of batteries, so and I don't know where my cord is. So I've got to use my webcam until I can find my cord. Now I'm going to put a little eyeliner on. Right under eyes. Yeah. My lower lid, rather. I'm going to put it on the top, not too much. Now, this liner, I really don't know why I got this liner. It's horrible at um, staying. It doesn't have any staying power whatsoever. So, what I do to combat that is I use my... Feather Light Mineral Veil from Bare Minerals and my concealer brush. And I get a little bit into the lid and put a little bit on there. It looks like a lot, but it's really not a lot. And I just press it into right under where my line is, my liner. What this does is it kind of it acts as a barrier try to stop my liner from running. And it doesn't work all the time, but it helps. What what I just need is a better eyeliner. And it, that eyeliner, I love it because it goes on very easily, very dark, but it doesn't stay whatsoever. 
like in an hour this liner is going to be all smudgy. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I have a an old um, Bare Minerals cap that I'm going to put my um, faux tan in if I can find it. What in the world is it? Oh, here it is. Um, this is, it's a little bitty thing of faux tan from Bare Minerals, and I'm almost out of it, but, um, I think I've still got a pretty good bit in there. So, tap some in there. Do a tap. That should be enough. I'm not trying to go too dark today, because... You know, like I said, I'm not really going anywhere and I need to look super nice for her, so. And I'm going to just kind of push it over my face. Try to give me a little bit more color than I have, which isn't much. But, okay. Next, I'm going to do my blush. So I'm having the hardest time finding stuff in here today. Um, here's, oh, I already had my blush out. I was like, seriously, where's my blush? Okay. And I use Secret from Bare Minerals blush. Well, it's the blush from Bare Minerals and it's the color is Secret. So, and I'm using my angled face brush, and I'm just going to go along the apples of my cheeks up into my temples. I know y'all really can't see this too well, but I will take a picture for you and put it at the end. Okay, next I'm going to take my white eyeliner. This is Flashy Silver from Sephora. And I'm going to go along with my bottom liner, right under my liner line, and then right on the inside corner of my eye. Y'all know what this is for. I can just brighten it up a little bit. Especially me since I have such dark, naturally dark eyelashes. And today I'm actually going to do for my, um... Oh, I forgot something. This is um, called Bare Minerals Pure Radiance. It comes in a little pot like this. I'm going to use my angle face brush. Actually, no. I'm not going to use my angle face brush. I'm going to use my. No, not that one. My. Okay, I'm so sick of this. Flawless face brush. Finally, it's just a little face brush. You can use for powder or anything. I'm gonna get a little bit into my um, leftover lid. Well, it, what this does, it kind of gives you that like glow, that like dewy glow look. Kind of that little innocent. Summer look. Okay, now what I'm gonna do is, um, I'm just gonna have gold eyeshadow today. I don't really feel like doing any kind of eyeshadow look since I'm not going anywhere. Important. So I have it's called Aztec Gold by Ulta. It's the Ulta brand it's on sale right now. That you get you free. And I have my eyeshadow brush. And the only thing that really um, changes from day to day with my daily makeup is the color of my eyeshadow. And it's really just whatever I feel like on that day. Like today, I just feel like a little gold. Because this, because this gold is not too flashy gold. It's kind of a muted um, tawny gold almost. 
don't feel too bad about wearing it just for my parents. I'm going to get a little bit up onto my brow bone. Not too much. So, I know y'all can't see this, but it's a really muted color. If I wanted to, I could put a little bit of brown in there or, um, maybe a little mauve color on my lid. I think, actually, what I'm going to do is get my Pure Radiant. Oh, no. Oh, no. No, I will get my Pure Radiant that I just had out. I've already lost it. There it is. Since this color actually um, is kind of a mauve color, really shimmery, but um, I'm going to put this on my lid. Not too much. Oh yeah, I like that. Just kind of almost a, uh, like a vanilla look. Like if you were to take like warm vanilla sugar fragrance from Bath and Body Works and make it into an eyeshadow, that's what it would look like to me. So, um, then I'm just going to follow up with a little swipe of eyeliner. I just have NYC eyeliner and jet black. I don't really like colored oh, right, mascara, rather. I don't n every day use mascara. But some days I do. So it's only been. Okay, so that's my normal everyday kind of look. My eyeliner looks super dark, but it, I promise it's actually not that um, crazy looking. But I'll take some pictures for you. And um, also, I want to show you some days I use lipstick, not very often. Some days I do. And this is NYC Lipstick in Blossom number 376. Put that on. And then I like to take one of my eyeshadows and kind of pat it on just to give it kind of a more muted color. So I'm not a really big pink lipstick fan. So, okay. Uh, that's it. So, um, that's my everyday makeup. Um, my eyebrows are a little raggedy, but I don't really care today. So. Alright, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you later. Bye.